Hello and how are you doing? I hope that you're having a fantastic day. I'm having a great day today and I want to share with you something really important. I'm going to show you how you can buy $100 in cryptocurrency and get up to $100 in bonuses. Now, if you actually do the work to get $100 in bonuses, that makes your cryptocurrency purchase pretty much free. It puts you in a position where you could lose all $100 of your cryptocurrency investment and you're still actually ahead. So let me show you how this works. Be sure to watch the video all the way to the end. I'm going to start out by talking to you about a basic cryptocurrency investing strategy that's designed to help you make money. Then we're going to talk about how to create an account so that you can purchase your $100 in crypto. And then finally, we're going to end by talking about the bonuses and talking about how you can get up to $100 in bonuses so that your cryptocurrency, so that you've basically hedged your cryptocurrency investment. So hang on. This is going to be a great ride. I hope you enjoy the entire video. Now, should I buy Bitcoin now or should I wait? We're going to give you ideas that will help you take profits and avoid losses. Can we get this video to 99 likes? Smash that like button. It really helps us out. It makes a big difference with the Google algorithms and the other search engines. Um, now, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. This is my opinion. And, you know, for most of you out there, you don't know who I am. And so I'm just some Joe on YouTube. Take what I say with a grain of salt. Go do some research. Deep, dig a little bit deeper because you want to make a good choice. And so you want to get information from a variety of sources. I have a particular perspective on things. Somebody else has a different way of viewing the very same things. And when you get information from a variety of sources, you're going to have a better, well-rounded opinion that'll be based on good information. Well, as long as the people you're listening to are providing you with quality information, you'll make a better decision because you've had quality information. So you definitely want to make sure you're hearing from good people. The quality, you know, getting quality information. Now, cryptocurrency involves substantial risk of loss. We're going to try and help you find ways to avoid that loss, but the reality is you could lose everything with cryptocurrency. Now, the reality is with any kind of investment, you could lose everything with any kind of investment, no matter what it is. There's things that can happen. And so, be sure to read the rest of this paragraph. We're not going to cover it, but it is there. You can pause the video. It is actually really good advice, and it's there to help you prevent you from doing any kind of uh, mistake that would actually hurt you and your family, and we don't want you to do that. So I'm going to start talking about a investment strategy, and it's more of a frame of mind than anything else. Um, some people think that the best way to make money with stocks or cryptocurrency is to go out and trade every day by, by sitting in front of the computer and watching the prices and you're going to pull the trigger when it gets up there and you'll, you'll wait for it to hit the bottom before you buy. And, and that's not what you want to do with cryptocurrency. With Bitcoin, if you bought a thousand dollars and held it, did nothing with it, just held it for three years, this is what would happen to you. So we can only look backwards in time to be able to answer that question. But if you bought $1,000 worth of Bitcoin on January 1, 2017 and held it until December 31st, 2019, you would have $7,206. And you can look throughout the rest of these dates. There, the, It covers all of the different three-year periods all the way back to the beginning of cryptocurrency. Now, when I first started looking at the numbers for cryptocurrency, I was amazed and I started asking myself the question, how long would I have to buy and hold Bitcoin 
for me to get a get a profit be, be profitable 100% of the time. And I found that one years didn't do that, two years didn't do that, but if I did it for three years, that 98% of the time, now you could pick any date between today, yesterday, a month ago, a year ago, five years ago, you could pick any date and 98% of those dates would show a profit if you bought Bitcoin and held it for three years. So historically, Bitcoin has proven itself to be a good investment. And in most cases, it was a good investment because you held it for about three years or longer. Because longer you would actually, in most cases, make even more money. There's only a few cases where that does not hold true. but um, and, and those few cases are more like three years and a month or three years and six months or something like that. Anyway, I'm getting, I'm getting sidetracked and going into too much detail. Here's the point I'm making. When you invest in cryptocurrency, whether it's Bitcoin or one of the crypto, other cryptos out there, think more long term. Think about holding it for months or years rather than weeks or days or even hours um, because that gives you a better chance of making money. And we want to give you ideas to help you take profits and avoid losses. The only people I know of that have actually lost money with Bitcoin or cryptocurrency are people that held it for less than three years. Um, but when you look at the historical data, the historical data backs that up as well. Now, here's the tough part. Saying hold it for three years is easy from a conversational basis, but sometimes it can be very hard to do because you're going to see the price of Bitcoin drop dramatically from time to time. And sometimes when that price drops, you have a temptation to say, I'm getting out. And that's oftentimes the worst time to get out because if you get out when the price is down, you, you're, like, you're gonna lose money. And if you wait until the price gets up and then get out, then you can get out on a profit. So anyway, just a little bit of, of, of some ideas. Now, a lot of people tell me, oh my gosh, Bitcoin is thousands of dollars. It's too late. I can't make money with Bitcoin. That's not true. If you look at this year alone and you bought Bitcoin on January 1, 2020, it was selling at $7,174 per Bitcoin. Today, September 9th, 2020, Bitcoin is selling for $10,240. That is 43% growth in nine months. Now, I don't know of any, I mean, Tell me of something that you could have invested in and gotten a 43% return in nine months. Now you may say, oh, well, that's Bitcoin. That's not going to happen with any of the other cryptocurrencies. Well, I can give you examples of other cryptocurrencies where it was even more. There's cryptocurrencies out there where if you had bought it on January 1, today you would have 100% uh, growth. 200, 300, 600 percent growth. If you had bought Link on January 1 a year ago, today you would be up by 500 percent in nine months. And so there's cryptocurrencies out there that are having tremendous growth this year. I don't want you to miss out and we're showing you how to get an account set up so that you can start buying and investing in cryptocurrency so that you don't need to miss out. So how do you set up and purchase cryptocurrency? We're gonna show you how to set up a Coinbase account. The first thing you wanna do so that you can start getting your bonuses is use this link. This link is important because this is part of how you're going to get your $100 in bonuses. So go to bit.ly slash Coinbase underscore Lumen8. That is my link and it will send you to Coinbase. And by, by, by setting up your account on Coinbase 
and investing $100 or more in crypto, you're going to get $10. So that will get you started. That's your first bonus. That'll get you started towards that $100 in bonuses that we're talking about. But let's dig in because there's more to come. So how you create your account is once you go to this page, you're going to fill in the fields. You'll fill in your first name, your last name, your email address, your password. You'll create your own password. You don't need to know a password in advance. And then you'll tell them where do you live, what state or what country. And you're going to certify that you're 18 years of age or older. And finally, you'll click the create an account button. The next step is you'll get an email and you need to verify your email address by clicking the link in the email. So you open up your email uh, software, however you like to read emails, and in the email you just received from Coinbase is a link, and you're going to click that link to verify your email address. Once you've done that, then the next step is you need to fund your account. You need to put money into your account so that you can buy and sell cryptocurrencies. And you can fund your account by connecting up your bank account to your Coinbase account. You can use a debit card. You can do a wire transfer. Or you can use PayPal. And I'm sorry, PayPal, you cannot fund your account through PayPal. But you can do a withdrawal using PayPal. And so once you have, and once you have Lambo money in your cryptocurrency account, you can send all that money off to PayPal if you choose to do so. All right, so now we've got money in our account. What are we gonna do with it? We're gonna buy some cryptocurrency. On Coinbase, they have 24-ish different cryptocurrencies. And I say ish because they're always changing things up. They're mostly adding new cryptocurrencies to Coinbase. And so uh, what you do wanna watch out for, though, is you don't wanna invest in a stable coin. So this coin down here called DAI, is called a stable coin. Notice how the price is right at $1.02. That's actually unusual. Normally, DAI is right at $1 and it stays at $1, but it uses a math algorithm to keep adjusting the price. So once in a while, it does get a little bit off. And in this particular screenshot, it had gone up by about two cents. But you'll notice that for the most part, a stable coin is going to be right at that $1 price. Uh, Coinbase has three or four different stable coins. The last time I looked, it was at four. Um, and so stable coins are good. It's a good place to let your money rest when you want to pull money out of the market and you, you don't have a particular crypto that you want to invest in at that moment. Now, that's if you're not going to be doing, you know, what I was recommending as far as more of a long-term investment strategy. But putting it into a stable coin is a good place if you find that you actually want to take it out of the market and put it in something that's just going to maintain that $1 value. Um, now, uh, you're going to find that the 20 cryptocurrencies that are available on Coinbase are some of the best in the industry. They're the most reliable companies, the most solid companies. Um, now, I shouldn't say companies because Bitcoin, Ethereum, and several others don't have any company backing them. They just have software that's maintained by a group of volunteers. Some of them actually get paid for their efforts, um, but they don't actually, there's no office for Bitcoin. You can't go to the Bitcoin office, does not exist. Um, so that was kind of a mistake on my part. Anyway, bottom line, you have about 20 or so that you can invest in. If I were doing this, I would start out by putting, uh, I would decide, decide how much money I want to put into each, each cryptocurrency. And even if I didn't have enough to put it into all of them, I would say maybe I want to do $50 or maybe I want to do $500. Whatever that dollar amount that I choose is, I would probably put the same amount in everything on Coinbase except for the ones that are stable coins. And then I would set up something where I was withdrawing money out of my bank account or out of my debit card or whatever, uh, 
however I set up my Coinbase account and I would have it auto deducted on a monthly basis or on a weekly basis. You can do it on a regular basis and that's what's called dollar cost averaging. It's the same thing as when you set up a retirement account with the company you work for. When you set up a retirement account, every time you get paid, before they give you your paycheck, they've already removed a certain amount of money every paycheck for your retirement account. And I would recommend that you consider the possibility of doing the same thing with your Coinbase account. It's a good way to invest in a large variety of coins that way, if any one coin tanks and really goes, uh, does something bad, it doesn't really hurt you. And you've got a whole, you've got a little bit of money in coins that are going to go really, really big. Now, I mentioned the coin that went up by 600%, 500% in the last year. That's a coin called Link, L I N K, and it is listed on Coinbase. And so, if you want to start putting money into that cryptocurrency, you can once you have set up a Coinbase account. So those are the basics. Let's talk about the bonuses. How do you make some more money? Well, the first one, the first bonus was open up your Coinbase account by using this link. And once you open it up and fund it with $100 and buy $100 worth of Bitcoin or other cryptocurrencies, doesn't have to be Bitcoin, you're going to get $10 in Bitcoin deposited into your Coinbase account. The other ways to do it is also to use the Coinbase Earn, and it really is more like Coinbase Learn with an L. Um, the final way is you're going to be able to share a Coinbase link. Now I'm going to go into more details about Coinbase Earn here in a minute. It'll be on the next slide. But before I go into Coinbase Earn, I wanted to tell you about your Coinbase link. So this is my Coinbase link. Coinbase will give you your own link. Now it won't start with Bitly, that's a different service. Um, but it will start with Coinbase.com, blah, blah, blah. Once you have your Coinbase link, you can give that to friends and relatives or people you just met. And when they use your link, to go to Coinbase and they deposit $100 into their Coinbase account, they're gonna get 10 bucks and you get 10 bucks. And you can do that for an unlimited number of people. And so every time you do that, you earn another $10 and that's how you can actually make more than $100 um, in, in terms of using Coinbase and far exceed uh, what you actually have invested in cryptocurrency, depending on how much you actually put in. Now, Coinbase Earn allows you to earn up to $115 of additional money. And how they do it is Coinbase has set up programs where they have done a, a joint venture with different cryptocurrencies and they have videos that'll teach you about their cryptocurrency and while you're learning, they're going to pay you to learn. And so here's how it works. They break everything down into short two minute videos and for each two minute video you watch, they're gonna give you one question. Now I don't like that they call it complete a quiz. There is no quiz. You get one question per video. The question is multiple choice and the answers are really simple. You'll look at the, the answers that they give you and you'll go, well, those three weren't even talked about in the video and I see this one, I remember them saying something about it, so I'm gonna pick that one and that's, that's, that's gonna be the right answer. And so you'll find that the, they made the questions really easy, so as long as you actually did listen and watch the video, you'll know which one's the right answer. And you can answer most of the different cryptocurrencies that they've set this up with, you're going to get about $6 to $15 uh, just by answering, watching videos and answering their questions. Now, the other way that you'll be able to use Coinbase Earn is you, they will give you links for some of the different cryptos. And when you share that link, you get $10 when a friend of yours actually watches the video. And if they earn $10, then you get 10 bucks. 
And so all of that is covered in detail. Once you get inside a Coinbase, they'll go into those details and give you all the pertinent information. But you can get really close to that $100 just by watching the videos and answering the questions. And every, I, I, I hate to say how often they do it because it's not on a scheduled basis, but on a, from time to time they'll set up a new cryptocurrency and you'll be able to go to Coinbase Earn and earn more money on that new cryptocurrency just by taking the videos and quizzes. And so you're not limited to the 115 that's out there today, um, but given time, you'll be able to actually earn more when they add new videos and new cryptocurrencies to their current program. All right, so that's my video for you today. I hope you take advantage of this and actually uh, set up a Coinbase account and invest a, a small amount of money into Bitcoin and into cryptocurrency. I think it could be the beginning of something that changes your life forever. And that's really what I, I really want to be able to do is I want to be able to help you out and change your life forever financially. Um, and so that's my desire. And I hope that we can achieve that desire together. In the meantime, how can I be of service to you? Do you have questions, thoughts, comments? Leave them on the webpage below. Um, in the meantime, I hope that you'll like, subscribe, and hodl. And do me a favor, have a fantastic day.